we thought that since everybody was home right now that it would be super fun to share some easy, easy card games that we play all the time as a family. And so I gathered my family and they're gonna willingly participate in this. <laughs> Let me flip the camera around to show you. All right, these are our game players, Julia, Drew, and Josh. Josh is actually gonna teach how to play All the right, game. let's do it. Okay, so you take two decks of cards and you can play this between two or probably six players. If you wanted more, I'd probably add another deck of cards. It's like rummy, where you're trying to make either runs of the same suit or sets. Three of the same card, four of the same card, or five of the same card. If you look at the scorecard, each round has a different number of cards that are dealt. First one is three, four, five, six, seven, etc. So we'll start off with three. And the first person to play has an option of either taking a card from the top of the deck or taking from the discard. Okay, so since we're on the first round, we all have three cards. And as soon as we can have all of our three cards either be a straight in the same suit or a set, we can knock. And what is a straight? Like four, five, six of hearts, or king, or I should, I'm sorry, ten, jack, queen of spades. Aces are always low, they're always one, and king is always high. And are there any wilds? Yes, there are two jokers in the deck, and they can be anything you want them to be. And also, each round, there's a wild too, right? Correct. Since we're on, that's like the number one rule. Since we're on the level three, all threes are wild. And when we go to the next round and we're on fours, we'll be dealing four cards to everybody and fours will be wild. Next round, five cards, fives are wild, all the way up through king, which is 13 cards and kings would be wild. So, all right. So since I dealt, the person to the left of the dealer goes first, which will be Mickey. And we just rotate the deal with each okay, one. Okay, and these are my cards. What do you guys think? I'm actually gonna lay down my cards just so it's easier to tape. I have a nine and a king and a joker, which is lucky. But look right here, I could pull from this or pick this up. And since it's a nine, I'm gonna switch my king out. And I have three of a kind. So I'm gonna knock. And then everyone, this is my discard, and then everyone at the table has one more turn, so. Now, we have to total up our points at the end, and they're used against us. So right now, since we only have one more turn, if we can't make a set, we're gonna try to get rid of the highest cards that we have. Um, oh, okay, so. <laughs> I don't have a set, so I have to add that up. Face cards are worth 10, aces are worth one, everything else is face value, so I have 21 points. Okay, and how many do you have, Drew? I have 21 points. Because 10? 10. 10. Further rounds, when we have six or nine cards, any set that you make with a three doesn't get counted against you. So if I were to have a jack, four, and a seven, and three eights, the three eights make a set, so they're not counted against me with points. Right now, with only three cards, though, I'm, everything is basically counted against you. So, 21 points, 21 points, 14 points. Okay, and I went out, so I get zero. What'd you say, Josh? 21? 21, 21 14, 14, and 21. So, the scoring is like golf. You want a low score. Now, typically, the next deal would go to Mickey, but because she's recording, I'll deal for her. I'll start with Julia. And now we go to four cards. Now, the runs can be anywhere from three to eight cards, I guess, and so could the sets, but the minimum is runs of three or sets of three. So, uh, Julia, it's your turn to go first. And now that it's four cards, fours are wild. Correct, fours are wild. And with each round, if it's if you're on fours, it's four is wild. If you're on tens, tens are wild. If you're on jacks, jacks are wild. Now it's important to remember what wild cards are for each round because invariably someone in the family will always discard a wild card, not realizing that it's wild that round. Oh, oh. continue this all the way through, through five cards, six cards, seven cards, all the way up to the king, which would make that the 11th round because we start at threes. And we total up the points, and whoever has the lowest amount of points is the winner. I had them the whole time until right about here. 
And Josh beat me by two. Anyways, here's the aftermath. The longest- Nikki, it's your turn! <laughs>